Here is Gene Shaw, partner of El Ray, to demonstrate for you the new El Ray tire testing machine DDS 1220. In order to start the process, the operator moves the tire on a manual conveyor up to the edge of the dome. An electric conveyor moves the tire into the test position. Then the operator moves to the safe position and presses the run button. From here on, the operation is autonomous. The dome comes down and the cameras come up inside of the tire and the vacuum cycle starts. During the vacuum cycle stressing the tire, the cameras take images of the inside of the tire. At the end of the vacuum cycle, the cameras move 90 degrees and then the vacuum is released and the cameras take additional images. The features of this machine include a touchscreen operators panel, a keyboard in a lockable drawer, an onboard printer, and a USB port for transferring data. When the operation is complete, the cameras go down, the dome goes up, and the tire is ejected. You have just viewed a demonstration of the El Rey DVS-1220 Deferometric Tire Testing Machine. This machine uses the science of deferometry and gives results as shown here. Eight images of 90 degrees each, four up and four down of the inside of the tire, starting with the O in DOT as zero degrees, going clockwise. Depending on the tire size, the images may overlap both horizontally and vertically. An anomaly present in an upper image may also be visible in the lower image. As an example, this test tire has programmed anomalies that are in the center of the belt and are seen in both the upper and lower images. Also, an anomaly seen in the right or left edge of an image may also be seen in an adjacent image edge. Deferograms are displayed in 256 shades of gray. The darker the area, the more movement of the surface. Voids and separations are displayed with a defined edge. Surface movements from other causes are shown as a darkened area. No complex shapes have to be analyzed. These results may also be viewed with the computer processed information overlaid on the original image of the tire being tested. For further information on interpretation of an image, please see the document DBS 1220 Intro or contact El Ray. Plain and simple, it all comes down to interpretation, speed, and cost per tire. The same information is available from other types of non-destructive tire testing machines, which our company has sold for many years in 24 countries, but it's difficult to interpret and too slow for production line testing of every tire. After learning about the benefits of differometry, I'm sure you will agree with the many advantages of the El Ray Differometric Tire Testing Systems.